A message from the Earth Allies. Humanity is really not ignorant. Part 1. The truth about the innocence of humanity. Innocence. Guiltless, clear, uncorrupted, not dangerous or harmful. A young child. Greetings, love beings. We would like to have a discussion with you about innocence and ignorance. And humanity really is not ignorant. They've just been programmed. You see, innocence allows, embraces, and does not question. Because innocence trusts the experience of love in every moment. And love is always there. Love always responds. What else can love accomplish? When a being is unconscious, which takes place through the ignorance of themselves, ignoring their own call to awaken into the truth, in this state, the being becomes doubly unable to distinguish reality from illusion. Root cause is being in the illusion mind ego program. You see, ignorance attempts to confuse the being by providing disinformation contained in belief systems, fantasies, and illusions. All illusion, a.k.a. ignorance, is dense matter or low vibrational thoughts, also referred to as unconsciousness. The illusion, which is the programmed ego mind, attempts to grasp onto what it thinks reality is or should be. It analyzes and interprets information that is intellectual materialism at its finest. It is always looking outside to fill up on, mostly through manipulating others for energy and control. True reality, creation, cannot be manipulated or controlled. It is living from within, connected to source energy, and expressing this outwardly, from the inside out. Love has nothing to analyze or interpret. Love is always love, expressing love. Love is divine intelligence, equal creation. Your true being, once awakened, innately and automatically recognizes and understands all of life, for each being is uniquely all that is, and love is all there is. Ignorance questions, reacts in a fight or flight reaction to attempt to continue its survival. Ignorance hides from the light because when love is present, love shines the light on the dark and ignorance disappears. As darkness is only the absence of light, Ignorance is the absence of being present in the moment of now. In truth, humanity are innocent beings, divine beings, once they awaken from out of the illusion, a.k.a. ignorance. Then they are in true reality, where magic and miracles come alive. This is where the true being is now present and expressed freely. Love is always giving. Its function could never take. It's impossible. Love is always overly abundant, the cup that keeps filling up. Love has everything, and love is everything. Innocence is a childlike quality of love, not childish. Innocence is the true essence of who all of humanity is, as true light beings, childlike wonder and magic. This experience exists only in the present moment of now, which is all there really is. <clears throat> Every moment <clears throat> is new. This is creation. This is presentness, love being everywhere present. Ambivalence, the coexistence of conflicting attitudes or emotions Uncertainty as to which course to follow. Life, in true reality, 
is something far grander than what humanity has been taught in illusion, which was ambivalence. Living life in true reality is more like passion and excitement as a child on Christmas Eve who is waiting for their presents. They are so excited and cannot wait to open them. The childlike innocence equal inner peace, equal true reality that has been forgotten is the truth of who humanity really is. Now again, we did not say childish. We said childlike. Humanity's childlikeness and innocence is what all of humanity are returning to. Everyone on this planet, whether aware or unaware, are each royal angels. And in truth, humanity came here to play in the Garden of Eden. This childlike innocence can only occur if humanity is present in the moment of now. This is where they will experience the true wonderment and awe of creation. True reality in living life real unfolds, which equals your real life. Now, there's a huge difference between ignorance and innocence. Ignorance sees innocence as dumb, weak, and meek. But remember, the meek shall inherit the earth. It misunderstands kindness for weakness and love is something you take from others or someone else gives you, which is energy competition. Ignorance cannot see anything outside of the box. However, once the being lets go and steps out of the box, there is no more ignorance. Ignorance is not creation or love. It's nothing. It is but an illusion. Its only purpose is destruction, corruption, greed, power over experience, death, pain, suffering. And as we refer to it, it only takes. It's like a constant taker. It, it has nothing to give <clears throat> but emptiness and more nothingness. The internal dialogue is the program ego mind. This is also ignorance's connection to the unconsciousness. For a being to truly awaken, the internal dialogue has to be shut off. This disconnects the being from the old energy of collective unconsciousness, which is the ignorance. Then, the real being can step forward and be present and live life real. Without the internal dialogue or programming, humanity will then be able to connect into their higher self, source, and eternal life. Unconsciousness is the playground for ignorance. We're going to take that playground down and install in a garden. That gets a yeehaw. And transmission in all love is unconditionally, and this is the end of part one. More to come. We love you very much with all of our heart. Love, the Earth Allies.